What's up YouTube? Uh, back here with another video. This is Aaron. Uh, playing some Black Ops 3 Domination on... I don't remember what this map is called. Maybe Fringe? I don't know. I can't remember map names. I am just started playing this again because I just got live. And I'm, I'm enjoying it even though I'm terrible at Call of Duty. I've always been terrible at it. I actually think this is the first game where I may have a positive KD, like an over like 1.09 or something like that. But I've been having a lot of fun with it, playing with my boy Dustin, who I'm pretty sure leads this lobby at the end of the game. Um, although this took me like 10 tries to actually record because I'm an idiot. But beside that, you know, I may sound a little weird. I'm a little sick right now, and you know that's just what happens. You get sick. Uh, I'm pretty sure they go down to like three players at some point in this game or we're getting trash right now. Look at this, we're getting triple capped. What kind of BS is this? That's the problem with playing this game. I'll I'll be playing, uh, my friend Dustin and I will be capping and like at the end of the game it'll I will have like six or seven caps, Dustin will have five or six, and then everyone else will have maybe one, one or two. And I'm like, how what are you doing? This isn't team deathmatch. This is Domination, you gotta cap these flags, man. But, you know, that's beside the point because people can play how they want, even though it's wrong. I think I'm, I definitely play it right because I, I'm me. But, yeah, I'm terrible at this game. That's why I got into editing videos. And I wanna get back into it a bit because I miss editing and I don't know. I don't know what, to, like, I mean, I can edit this a bit, but there's not much. I, I don't know what I want to do. I want to work on something. I want to work on a big project to edit it, but I have no clue what to do. So if you have any suggestions or if you want anyone to edit anything for you, I can do it while I'm on break for the next few days or whenever I come home over, because I'm in college right now. I'm a broke college student, so I don't get to come home that often. But um, whenever I am home, I'll edit. Uh, so if you have anything you want to be edited, just send me a message or something because I'm down. I do, I'll do it for fun, free, whatever. Um, just let me know if you have suggestions or if you want anything. Yeah, again, sorry for being sick. My nose has been stuffy. I came home. Right as soon as I get home, I get sick. That's just my luck. Um, but yeah, I'm on spring break right now, which most people on spring break, you know, they go somewhere nice, whatever. But as I said, I'm a broke college student, so nowhere nice for me. That's just how it happens. College, don't do it. It's not fun. I mean, it's fun for some people, but my college isn't fun. And that's just, I, I chose it, so I guess it's my own fault. But I wanted, I know what I want to do with my future, and the school that I'm at helps me out. It's one of the uh, best engineering schools in the nation. So hopefully one day, if I get lucky, well, if I do well, it's not really luck, it's just working hard. Uh, what I want to do is, I'm an electrical engineer, but I'm doing a computer focus because I want to do computer architecture and design like processors and stuff hopefully work for intel one day that's my dream we'll see how it goes because my gpa is right at a 300 exactly at a 300 and if i i need a 300 or better to be able to work there or most companies for a double e degree and i'm trying i'm working hard everyone always asks like oh are you getting a's there because i mean in high school i get a's because high school is super easy and I'm like yeah no I'm not I'm getting B's and C's like I'm at a 3.0 they're like oh I thought you'd be doing better I'm like you have no clue that is good there like I'm not doing as good as other people from my high school that are going there as well and there's of course people getting four O's, but for me to be able to get a 3.0 is just like I'm incredibly happy with that so I don't care what other people think because I know if those people went there the people getting going to like public schools and getting you know good grades there like I mean you may I mean you may do well at this school but most people would struggle way more than me and probably wouldn't last very long um, but actually a point I want to make here I'm not that good at aiming and I'm on like four sensitivity when I played this since then I've bumped it up to 11 and I'm still getting better I just I suck at aiming and we are getting wrecked right now. Look at this, 48 to 100. Maybe we lose this one. I don't know which gameplay I chose, but that doesn't matter because this is the one we're going with because I'm already halfway through it, so screw it. Ooh, I'm a, I'm a poet, man. I, oh, right here, my my friend joins the party while I'm trying to um, while I'm trying to record, and I'm pretty sure we start talking and stuff. So you may hear him in the background, but whatever. 
Um, so I guess I don't really know what else to talk about. I guess we'll talk about girls, man. Because that's always fun to talk about, right? Girls. Um, I guess it's, it's hard for me to talk about like girls' relationship stuff because I haven't been one for... I think it's been my senior year of high school, so yeah, two or three years um, since I've actually dated someone. And that, it kind of sucks. Ooh, look at that. Grab spikes. I hate... I, grab spikes, normally when I use these... I like start to do it and someone kills me before I smash the ground and I just I get killed and screwed over. But back to relationships slash girls, I can't talk. My my tongue doesn't want to work now, but you know you know. Um, I've had one in a while. I've taken a few girls on dates, but never seems to be the right the right one. That's I know it sounds weird. Like oh you don't know if you're gonna find the right one. Like I want. It's weird for me as a guy. Like I really want a relationship. I want to be in a relationship and I know it sounds like oh man he's kind of thirsty he wants whatever but I just know that like I want to make someone happy I want to like I want to have someone that I can like share life with like even if it's not I, I don't know I just feel like I want someone that I can like talk to all the time and have there for me and I can be there for and just like I I, I don't know and it sucks that like I'm okay without having it you know I have friends and stuff but it just it feels like there's something missing all the time and you know maybe I won't find someone for a while I just gotta you know live with how it is and look we triple cap him back you know put in work I can I don't think I get this guy yet no and so I've taken a few girls on dates and like I I, I just it just never seems to work out so that's the problem with my school is not every girl is like this but a lot of the girls at my school because there's not many girls they get this uh this I, we we have like a like a word for it that's like princess syndrome or whatever where because there's so little girls pretty much every guy like you, even if you're not that attractive of a person you're gonna have multiple guys going after you because the girls are so scarce and they some of them let that get to their heads and they talk to multiple guys and oh my air kicked on so that's good but, you know, it's, it's not fun for people like me that, you know, I'm not just going on dates with people to, like, you know, have fun for a bit and then, like, move on. I, 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 I don't like that. I don't want to, like, just move on and act like whatever. Because my problem is at any person I come in contact with, it doesn't matter who you are. Like, I automatically, like, I care about everyone that I've ever, like, met. And I know it sounds weird, like, how can you care about everyone? But for real, like, even if we met somewhere and like i held the door open for someone like i don't I, I don't look at that person like i am may not like when i'm going to bed be like oh i wonder how they're doing but i don't want any harm to come to that person like or if i be, if i meet you and i know your name and i'm friends with you then if something bad happens to you like that i feel like even though it's not something bad happens to me like it still affects me for some reason and oh i get up in here get on this little run you know, camp up there? Mm -mm, not, not in my house. I'm not gonna let you camp. And so I run down here. Ooh, you want another one? Okay. I jump up on this couch, reload, and wait for them to come back. And I kill a person a third time. And I think the other guy's camping up top again. And I get him again. But yeah, so I, I automatically care about people. And I guess it's like it's not a bad thing, but I mean it kind of sucks because when when you're like that, when you generally just want like even if say there's someone that I like like a girl I'm talking to and I really like but she doesn't feel the same like you know that sucks for me and she may go to like another guy and that guy see I think ah, that pissed me off but and that guy you know makes her happy like I'm not like I'm upset kind of like I'll be like sad that you know I wish I was the one that did was able to make you happy but like as long as you're happy like that's I'm I'm happy with that and like some guys they would try to like mess with that or whatever but like you can't I can't be mad when even though I would like to be the one that's you know there for you and making the person happy if they are happy like why should I try to do anything like I know some guys will like try to take her back or win her back or whatever and like you know I think about it but if she's happy then why why try to because what if that happened to you like what if you were talking to this girl, you started dating her, but there's another guy that, you know, was in the same situation where he was talking to her before she went with you, and he, like, 
cares about her a lot and then decides to like do whatever he can to win her back and then he does like that that fucks you over and i know it's like maybe i should think about myself more but I, i'm not like that i'm not i hate i don't know i it's just i don't know how to explain it i just know that like i i really care about other people like even that so that guy that she's with now this is a hypothetical hypothetical girl i don't know i said that really weird but even that guy she's with now like that guy even though i don't know him like i, I still care enough not to try to fuck him over and that's i don't know if that's a weird way to think or if i shouldn't think that way but that's the way i am and that's and it's kind of shitty sometimes but you know it's it's how it is and that's I don't know. I don't know why I just went on that rant. I don't know why it matters that much, because it really doesn't. Oh, here I forgot I needed to tap the controller. I was like, oh, shit, it's going dark. And, yeah, I guess that's the, the rant on relationships and my thoughts on caring about people. And you got to see how terrible I am at this game, but I think it, I did okay this time. But, ooh, look at that. See, I, I, I do that sometimes. I get those, like, where I just do super well for no reason. But... I don't know. I, I think what happens is I challenge too much. Like, I'll just sprint into a, a place where I know there's probably enemies and it just screws me over. But, um, yeah, that's that's all that. I don't know why I just went on that little rant there, but I did. I don't know how I didn't kill that guy. But, so, I guess, yeah. Um, I probably have a few more games of this. Some, I think I have some FIFA to post, but I don't know if you guys want to see more of uh, Call of Duty, more FIFA something on pc i don't know i have a pretty good pc right now so i can do any of that um yeah we end up winning this game by two one or two and uh, sorry sniffling on the yeah it's, it's bad but it was uh it was pretty sweet we were down by a lot and we came back and won i'm pretty hype about it but uh until next time this was aaron your boy's out